Let's try. In a collision between a tourist, 15 people were injured in a collision between a tourist bus and a truck on Highway 27 this morning. Um, 15 people were uh, injured in the collision. Eliminate them. In, in a collision. Much better. Good. Between a tourist bus and two highway. Twenty seven. Mm -hmm. um, this morning. Very good. This morning. Very good, eh? Very nice job. Did you study the audio? Mm, no, but I I wrote yesterday. Ah, okay. That I was those it. are were the words. That you yes. you got it yesterday. Okay. <laughs> Very good job. Here you have it. This is definitely the answer is B. Do you agree? Yeah. Yes. That is correct. Very good. Let's continue with number three. Perhaps. What answer you said yesterday? It is letter B, I think, no? Yes. You got letter B. Let's listen to it. Three. Police are investigating the theft of a diamond necklace worth $30,000. There. Mm, police are investigating. Mm, the the tough okay something okay. like that the tough the top uh -huh. the pronunciation is slightly different continue what else um necklace uh -huh. in dollars mm -hmm. Perfect. Let's check this new word that you are identifying. Transition. Theft. Theft. Exactly. Theft. 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 Exactly, because it's not a little t t t t. It's th. Theft. Theft. Okay. Theft. A theft is. A crime. Do you know what's a theft? No. It's when people steal something. Okay. You know, when mm -hmm. there is a person who takes a, a, a something very important from a museum, that's a theft. Okay. Mm -hmm. what, is the, what is the difference with steal? The, the difference with what? Steal. Still is a verb. Ah, this is a noun. This is a noun. Uh -huh. ah, That's okay. the reason we are investigating the... Okay, that theft. Exactly. They are investigating a, a crime. What kind of crime? Theft. The... Okay. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Listen again. Police are investigating the theft of a diamond necklace worth $30,000. Diamond? Yes. $1,000, but I don't know how, how, what, how many is. Maybe 30000 but I'm not sure. <laughs> You're close. You're very close. I think I heard 32, but I don't remember. Okay. Let's listen again. Final okay. chance. Three. Police are investigating the theft of a diamond necklace worth $30,000. Mm -hmm. mm. Mm. Diamond. Mm. 
Sniff of the. Nice. Eliminate the. You cannot say the diamond necklace. Okay. Because uh, which diamond necklace? Oh, a diamond? Exactly. Okay. With. Sounds similar. And? Mm -hmm. But what was the number? Do you remember the number? The number what? Uh, how many dollars? Mm, no, 30 mm -mm. or 40. All right, one more time. <laughs> Three. Police are investigating the theft of a diamond necklace worth $30,000. With... With 20, mm -mm, I don't know. 20? Oh, no, no, no. It was not 20. I think you are focusing too much on the on the mysterious word. The mysterious word is a new vocabulary. Okay. It's a new word. Look at... Whoops. This. Oh, B1, perfect. Please take a note and read. Action rocks. Uh, word? Oh, yeah. Word. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. Word. Use like a proposition followed by a noun, pronoun, or number, or by the or by the ing form of a verb. Mm -hmm. That's not the definition. That's only an indication, a grammatical indication. Ah, okay. Mm. Okay. Definition goes later. Uh, word, word, something, having a value in money. Uh -huh. Uh, our house is worth about uh, uh, 100,000? 100,000 pounds. Pounds. Mm -hmm. You see, it's talking about the value in money of something. It's worth $20. It's worth a million dollars, etc. But it's an adjective. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. It's an adjective. And it doesn't exist in Spanish. Welcome mm. to real English. How do you say worth in Spanish? I would say people say normally nuestra casa tiene un valor de. Uh -huh. Pero tiene un valor de. Tiene la palabra tener. We don't use have for this. It's worth. Is worth uh -huh, similar to H. I am 29 years old. Okay. Ah. Yes, okay. So it's a kind of a similar thing. Take a note and tell me when you're ready. Maybe police are investigating the theft of a diamond necklace. Where? What's the name neck. of this part of the body? Neck, necklace. Neck, exactly. Okay, necklace. Uh -huh. Word. Transition. Er. Word. Exactly. Word. Word. Okay. Necklace. Word. Mm -hmm. The number that I don't know. And the number that you don't know. I'm going to give it to you. She said 30. 30. Uh-huh. Mm, she okay. said 30. Listen to this. Three. Police are investigating the theft of a diamond necklace worth $30,000. The, the, reason, the reason we didn't catch it probably is because the the woman is, is British and she pronounces 30, not 30. Yeah, okay. That's the reason it was difficult. Remember to to study also British people. Okay, teacher. <laughs> Both the same. Jessica Asmore, number four. I was I shows. Mm -hmm. B. 
You chose B. Mm -hmm. B business, no? Let's listen. B business. The necklace was stolen from the out last night at four. Over 25,000 people turned out last night at Flushing Meadows to watch the finals of the U.S. Open Tennis Tournament. What did he say? Um, over. Mm -hmm. People. Mm -hmm. um, was the store. Um, well, people, I don't remember, only uh, was started. Extra information. Those words no? are not there. One more time. Word. Let's listen again. Yes. Four. Over 25,000 people turned out last night at Flushing Meadows to watch the finals of the U.S. Open Tennis Tournament. Mm. Over 25 mm -hmm. people hmm. Flushing Meadows? Mm -hmm. This is a this is the name of a of a location. Mm -hmm. There is a very good uh, comprehension on the phonetics. The location is called Flushing Meadows. And Flushing Meadows. Meadows. Uh huh. Flushing Meadows is a park with stadiums and with like a sports center where you can see events you see mm -hmm. uh, aha look at this okay so it's like a massive park aha these are the flushing meadows Okay. Okay. Do you have any other idea? Mm, no, really. Well, let me help you with new vocabulary. Yes, please. Turn. Yes. Turn. Turn to. Ah, uh, no, wait, 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 wait. I think that's not that's not the word. That's not the word. Aha. Uh -huh. Turn out. Yes. Turn out number three. To be present at an event. <laughs> Do you understand what what is to turn out? Yes. Right? Yes. What is the cookie yeah. you see? Uh, people turn it out. The yeah, eyes that's possible pronunciation. What is the passive turn? Turn it. Mm -hmm. What is the turn passive it? turn? Mm -hmm. Turn it. Much better. <laughs> turn it out. Uh huh. Flushing meadows. Mm -hmm. And what is the cookie you see in the dictionary? Find the cookie. Mm -hmm. 
No. No, Mister. A cookie is a word that is used, a connector that is used usually with the word. Okay. Find the connector that is together with it. Turn out. Mm. Off? But it, is, it doesn't say turn out off. Uh, two. Exactly. Cookies. You learn turn cookies by observation. Out. Uh -huh. No, not by guessing. Uh -huh. All right. Now, with yes. that in mind, let's listen again. Four. Over 25,000 people turned out last night at Flushing Meadows to watch the finals of the U.S. Open Tennis Tournament. Uh -huh. So it's over... Uh, 25,000 people mm -hmm. turned out mm -hmm. uh, to mm -hmm. um, Incorrect. turn out um, well uh, after flushing meadows uh, to watch Finally? Exactly. Very good. The, here is a cookie. To watch finally. Eliminate finally. Uh -huh, to watch. It sounds very similar, but it's not finally. They open? Mm hmm. I have another chance. Do I have another chance? Yes, of course, yes. No problem. <laughs> yes, I can I can give you one more. <laughs> Just because you know. asked. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go. Listen again. Over 25,000 people turned out last night at Flushing Meadows to watch the finals of the U.S. Open Tennis Tournament. Turned out last night? Mm -hmm. The Flushing? ¿Qué significaría the Flushing? Two flushing meadows. Okay, that sounds better. But you don't use turned out with connector two for destination. No. If um, turned out is similar to okay, continue, continue. To what watch. Else? Oh no, no, that's all. Do that's it really? Yes, I forgot. I I can't write. Well, I can't walk. No, 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 no. I couldn't write. write. <laughs> ah, yes. I couldn't write. Very good. Very good. Mm -hmm. Okay, yes. If turned out is similar to be present at an event, to be present at an event, like to go, no? Mm -hmm. The event is in a particular location, no? Okay. Yes. At... Aha. Where mm -hmm. would you put the connector at? Uh, uh, the night complete um, over 25 people turned only 25? out no 25,000 people turned out last night at Flushing Meadows exactly to With watch comprehension. With comprehension, you can complete this word. The word at, you can say it if you understand the idea. You don't need me for that. Yes, yes. I agree. Right. Over 25,000 people. Ba -ba -ba -ba. 
Fuzzy Meadows to watch. Okay, Rox, help, yes. Complete this sentence. Maybe final? Uh -huh. Close. Close. Do you know what we are talking about? Maybe the robots know. I'm not sure. I heard like tennis, tennis. Uh -huh. Yes. But we are talking about tennis. Tennis, I don't know. Oh, interesting. We need vocabulary. Girls, check this out. Rocks. Tournament. Exactly. Tournament. Tournament. A sport competition with a number of teams or players. Okay. Oh, look at these words. A golf tournament. A tennis tournament. A soccer tournament. A chess tournament. Do you understand tournament? It's like in Spanish, no? Kind of. Kind of. We have more syllables in English. Mm -hmm. But it's a competition. Uh -huh. What's okay. the name of the most famous tennis tournament? Sorry, teacher. I don't know about tennis. You don't know about tennis, but mm -hmm. you should, you you have heard it sometimes in commercials or mm, not teacher. I don't I know nothing. You know <laughs> literally nothing. Okay. Yes, nothing about tennis. <laughs> okay, and you yes? Do you know the name of the most popular tennis tournament name? No, not really. No. If you no. go to Cien Mexicanos Dijeron, you what would you say? Mm, no, I I will lost. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Read this, yes. One to three action. The US Open? Correct. In this case, it's golf competition, but we have ah, a U.S. tennis competition held each year, which is one of the sports Grand Slams events. It was play, first played in 1968 in New York and moved in 1978 to Flushing Meadow. It's the same place we're talking about here. Mm. Huh? Of course, you don't need uh, knowledge um, of, 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 well, you don't need knowledge of tennis for listening, but you need to detect these words because, for example, U.S. is universal, no? This is not necessarily talking about tennis. The word open is also pretty universal. You, yes, you understood open, remember? Open. Mm -hmm. You said open. Only that in this case, it was not the verb open or the description open. Mm -hmm. It was it was a name of the tournament. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. With this information, let's complete the sentence. Rox, your turn. Mm. 5,000 people turned out last four. Over 25,000 people turned out last night at Flushing Meadows to watch the finals of the U.S. Open Tennis Tournament. To watch the finals? Mm -hmm. The final? Mm -hmm. Not the other. Mm -hmm. The finals? What's mm -hmm. No, uh, no, no, no. Yes. no, stop. Ah, no, no, not the contrary. Okay, the chair is confusing. I'm sorry. <laughs> the finals, US, US Open, mm -hmm. tennis, mm -hmm. 
tournament, turn, tournament, tournament. Exactly. Yes, you can complete the missing words with knowledge. That? Yes. I know. Any other? Of? Of course. Complete idea. Okay. Over 25,000 people turned out last night at Flushing Meadows. 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 Flushing Meadows to watch the finals of the U.S. Open Tennis Tournament. Why, why finals? Because it's um, um, it's not only one match; it's uh, many matches. Okay. Uh -huh. It's like uh, it includes the semifinals, the quarters, quarters, semifinals, and final. Oh, okay. Uh -huh. The tennis tournament is a complete day. Like it's like I think I think it's seventy two, seventy two hours. Of, of matches. Mm, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, teacher. And also in the in any sport, in any sport, the word is finals. Okay. Mm, okay. So, yes, in this case, the answer is not B. It's letter A. Oh yeah. Probably we got confused uh, because Rox got the same. Probably we got confused because he mentions the U.S. In fact, teacher, I didn't understand. Uh, I imagine. It was, yes. it was a lot of vocabulary, no? Yes, because the, the new vocabulary is flesh and meadows, mm -hmm. tournament, turnout. Turnout was, was a tricky one. Uh -huh. Yes. Mm -hmm. Probably understanding turnout and finals, boom, you get it. Because tennis is very easy to understand. But turnout and finals, that was the, the keyword, the keywords. Flushing meadows, it's optional. You only need to understand turnout to know that it's an event. Copy turnout and copy finals. Final. Final. The last of a series of games or competitions in which the winner is decided. Copy that one. Any question? Not a chair. All right. Let me know when you're ready. So we can pass to the last one. Let's see if we can finish. I'm ready, teacher. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. What about yes? Um, yes, Mr. I'm ready. Finally. Let's begin with the last one. Jessica's more. Hands of the five. Seventy-five thousand fans of the group Black Eyed Peas were disappointed last night. The Action. Uh, seven. Uh... I don't know, those aren't fun. Mm -hmm. uh, Black and Peaks. Mm -hmm. World. Mm 
That's all. Okay, second play. Five. Seventy-five thousand fans of the group Black Eyed Peas were disappointed last night. The. F mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 74,000? Almost. Almost the number. Continue. Um, uh, of the group. Uh huh. Like a piece. Uh, were disappointed. Uh -huh. um, Uh, no more. No more. Interesting. With this information, you can understand. You're disappointed. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I mean, you cannot guess the words because this uh, you need information, but we know the answer with this. Yes, entertainment. Under exactly. Entertainment. Automatically, we can say that this is the answer. This. That's correct. So in this case, when we are talking about, automatically you can guess the name because, or you can guess the, the answer because you know Black Eyed Peas, mm -hmm. right? But if you don't know what is Black Eyed Peas, then you need the next information. Let's listen to finish it. Five. 75,000 fans of the group Black Eyed Peas were disappointed last night. Seventy five thousand. Correct. Disappointed last night. Disappointed last night on skip. Complete idea, yes. Or disappointed. Complete idea, yes. Don't read portions. We're in after disappointed. Aha, precisely. <laughs> Don't read only. <laughs> That section. Read everything. Ah, okay, okay. Uh, seven, seventy, seventy-five thousand fans thousand. of the group. Thousand, not thousand. Do, do, thousand. Thousand. Mm -hmm. Seventy-five thousand fans of the group Black Apes mm -hmm. were disappointed. The last night. Let me the... Last night. That's right. Easy peasy. The rest of the information is they didn't arrive, they they didn't come to the concert, etc. So with this okay. information, you can... yes, I understand why they were disappointed. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And the last one, it says that a severe snowstorm. Let me help you with it. A severe snowstorm caused traffic to come to a stop on all major highways and the major and the airport was forced to close down most of the morning. In this case, the answer, of course, is letter B. And I want you to make sure this is you come, you have all the new vocabulary. Okay. All this lesson we saw. The vocabulary losses, injure. Oh, wait. Uh -huh. mm. Theft, worse. Turn out, finals. Tournament. And in the last part, we have major forced and close out. 
those are the new words we have in this exercise. Take a note. Do you have any question? No, for the moment. All right, girls. We are done for today. Okay, teacher. We don't have a very good night. I hope you feel better, Rox. Thank you, teacher. Bye. See you later. Bye, teacher. Thank you, Bye. See you soon. Bye. Good night. You too.